In this video, you will learn how to provide overall feedback for an exam slash quiz in your course. You'll also learn how to give feedback for individual exam slash quiz questions to your students, and how to change settings to allow students to view feedback for individual questions in your exam or quiz. To leave overall feedback on a student's attempt on an exam or quiz, you must head over to the evaluation area of the quiz or exam you wish to leave feedback on. To do so, head over to the exams slash quizzes area in Brightspace. Please note, you could also go to the quick eval tool to get to the evaluation area for a quiz or exam as well. But for this video, I'll focus on accessing this area from this exams and quizzes menu in Brightspace. Once you have located the exam or quiz you wish to provide feedback on, click the downward facing arrow next to it. Then select Grade. Once here, find the student who you wish to begin evaluating, and then select the link to their attempt under their name. From here, you have an area where you can type out overall feedback for the student's attempt. If you scroll down, you can view individual questions the student answered. As an instructor, you can override the score for each question or provide a score for a question that requires a manual score. Below each question is a link that says, Expand Question Feedback. If you click on this, you can type feedback on that specific question. Once you are finished, you can publish the results to the student, or you can save your entered grades slash feedback as a draft. By default, feedback for individual questions cannot be viewed by the student, so you must change your exam slash quiz settings to allow for this. To do so, select the downward facing arrow next to your desired quiz, and then select Edit. From here, select Evaluation and Feedback. In this section, find the drop down that says No Questions. Here we can determine which type of questions we want the students to see when they complete their attempt. In the drop-down selector, your options are to show incorrect questions only with correct answers, incorrect questions only without correct answers, all questions with correct answers, and all questions without correct answers. Choose whichever one you would like, and when you select Save and Close, your students will then see those types of questions and the feedback associated with the questions that you provided. Thank you for watching. For more Brightspace related content, please subscribe to our channel.